Surprised and shocked are some of the words Baylor fans are using to describe new tailgating regulations. Baylor Athletics announced a partnership with Tailgate Guys for the 2020 football season at McLean Stadium. 25 News' Eliza Navarro is live outside the stadium with details on what these changes are going to mean. Eliza? Lindsay and during football season, this entire area around me is usually a sea filled with RVs, tents and lots of Baylor fans. And as you can tell, it's right across the street from the McLean Stadium. So it's filled with lots of fun and it's an experience that people look forward to year after year. However, with these new changes, things are going to look a little bit different this coming this coming fall. And some Baylor fans say they feel blindsided. It's more than just a football game. It's a weekend long experience. For some Baylor fans, tailgating is a rooted tradition. We have had tailgate days where the game starts at 7 o'clock p.m. and we're set up by Friday night normally. We're out there at 6 o'clock a.m. Earlier this week, Baylor Athletics announced a partnership with Tailgate Guys for 2020, and fans have questions about how this new partnership will change the way tailgating used to be. Some tailgaters tell me they are afraid of how it will hit their pocket the hardest. My biggest concern is, again, the cost, because if it's, you know, we're paying, I think, about $450, somewhere in that neighborhood for our, the spaces I've looked at for our comparable site, looks like it's going to be $4,500, because we have three spots. Jim Terrell already took action to get his questions answered. I actually composed a letter that I've just sent to the tailgate guys to ask, ask all those questions. What size are the spots? Will we have electricity and cable? What is the cost? John Maddox and Jim Terrell have been tailgating at Baylor games for more than five years and say they had no warning about these new changes. I guess that's the most disappointing thing right there is that as a tailgate person from each year, I have not received any kind of notice or anything about the changes, so it's kind of a surprise. Texas A&M already has a partnership with Tailgate Guys, and I spoke with Kevin Hurley, the Senior Associate Athletic Director, who tells me how tailgating has worked for them since partnering with Tailgate Guys. It works two ways. One, you pay for a package that will reserve your spot and comes with everything you need, or two, you arrive early and set up a place in the Land Rush area where you are able to set up your own stuff. Current Texas A&M students say the change didn't do much for them. It's the same experience, I think. Just as good and just as fun. Yeah, couldn't even tell a difference. But Baylor fans are not fully convinced. They talk about making this an elite tailgating experience. It's been an elite tailgating experience, best I can tell, for the last five years. We reached out to Tailgate Guys and Baylor Athletics and didn't hear back from any of them. I'm Eliza Navarro, 25 News, live in Waco. Eliza, thank you.